guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl by La Party Heaven. Hi guys. Um so welcome to our Christmas uh what would I call it? Christmas designs making or whatever. <laughs> anyway, welcome to you know a series of you know Christmas designs. So this year I'm not sure I'm gonna do a Christmas tree because I think I've got like three videos of a Christmas tree and uh, like I mentioned uh, a month ago, so that I wasn't really feeling, you know, and I'm, I'm still not, I still don't have my mojo back, like really back like that. So I don't know if I'm going to be doing a Christmas tree this year, but I'm just going to be keeping my design simple for this year. So the first one is the Christmas elf. Before I get into what we're doing today, if you're new to my channel, please, please, please subscribe because when you subscribe, it helps this channel grow seriously. Most of the people that watch me are not subscribed. I would say like maybe like 5% of people that watch this channel are the subscri are, are subscribers. Most of them are, are not subscribers, but I understand if this channel is not, you know, what you want to subscribe to. So it's absolutely fine. But if you love what I do on this channel, please, please, please subscribe. It's just clicking that button and, you know, you're in. All right. So we're doing uh, a Christmas health because, um, you know, it's really popular. I don't know what country you are watching me from, but I know in the UK, a lot of people love you know they love gifting out even with the fact that i am not promoting any christmas designs personally i've had customers reach out to me already customers have done it for and i'm going to be doing it for them this year but i'm not doing a lot of it but people do quite a lot of the health you know design so i'm going to do it as the first one so that you guys can recreate and sell to customers um so what you need is the elf and I know the popular one is with like the one I did last year is the stuffing of the elf into the bubble balloon but this kind of design should work too so we're gonna be doing this um, with this head and then a half body um, it, it would work with you know gifting the kids or if you're doing like a Christmas themed kind of decor it should work as part of your Design is simple and really straightforward. And then after this one, we're gonna have the uh, the globe kind of design, you know. And then we're gonna I'm gonna do a Christmas Santa too. And then I should do a, a snowman. So it would come out, you know, everything will come out in this November, so that you can, you know, um, sell to your customers or recreate for your kids. You know, I understand it's not everybody that is a balloon artist. Right, let me stop talking now and get on with the video um so for the design you're gonna need for the beige you're gonna need 11 inches balloons i've got green and red balloons you need 260q and you need a sizer if you have an automatic sizer that's good for you then i've got some five inches red and five inches green so my five inches i am double stuffed i just want the color to like be nicer really and then I've got my electric inflator here. I've got my hand pump. So we're going to first start off with the 11 inches balloon. So I've put my sizer on six for the first set of bays. You would also need water weight. So make sure you have water weight. I'm not going to be using that water weight or sand weight to put into the base of the first set of five balloons. So we're using clusters of five instead of clusters of four. So that is, you know, really round and nice. Because we're trying to build like a, a, a body. Um, so I would inflate my 11 inches first. So guys, the sizes of the balloons, um, are, you know, they are like of different sizes. So I'm going to still like put the sizes in the description so if you in case you do not get what i've said in the video you can check description so what i did was the first set of five balloons i inflated into six inches and then the second set of five balloons which is the red one i'm inflating right now i inflated into five inches so there's a 
a size difference of one inch between the two sets so that's like the base where the elf will sit on so for the main body of the elf which i used uh five inches for the first set of green yeah i inflated into four inches there about or five you could because it's five inches you can inflate it to no actually because it's the first set sorry you inflate into three inches because the first set you're going to put on the big base it has to be small so you inflate into three inches then the next set of five you inflate into like 4.5 inches because that's the middle of the body you know the middle of the body will be kind of like wider than the you know the torso area and then the next set which is the red one will be like four inches so the difference between the the first set of red and the green shouldn't be too much and then the one that comes on top of the red the last set of five of reds before the neck bit you inflate into three inches or 3.5 inches also so that gives you the body i hope you get what i mean so then you have to put everything together which i'll be showing in a bit So it's time to put everything together so remember the first the bigger set which is the green one you tie them together making a cluster of 10. i also use the 260q to bring everything together um you could just use it you could use the neck of the balloon or a 260q it just depends on you but i preferred using the 260q to bring everything together so the greens go first, then the reds. So for the neck area, what I did was I took two five inches balloon and I broke it into two. And then the two, I wrapped it together to make four. So that was what I used for the neck. So you use two balloons, you know, inflated into like two inches and then you wrap them together. That would form the neck with ease. Now for the hands bit, I'm going to be using 260Q. Obviously the elf has, elves always have like really long hands. So just inflate your 260Q, leaving it a bit at the end and then what I did next was I wanted the hands and the the feet to have like a 3D kind of effect. So what I did was I cut a 260Q into two and then I put the halves into the white balloon. The white five inches balloon. And then I inflated the five inches balloon first and then inflated the 260Q afterwards. So... You know how we do the balloon flower It's the same technique you would use for the hands. So after you've done that, you get your 260Q, you do two pinch twists and then you wrap the five inches with 260Q inside round you. So that gives you the hand effect. As you can see, I am bending the hand parts to give you that curvy kind of hand effect.
So bend the 260Q like halfway. So you have like the curvy kind of, you know, how we curve our hands or legs and all of that. So you can re easily maneuver the 260Q without stress. So also what I did was to get equal size of hands and legs on both sides. Sides. What I've done is I've used one hand to measure the other to see if they are of the same height or the same length. So I put everything together, you wrap the hands around the body. And then you wrap the legs round. Next, you attach the head. So initially, I was going to use a really big head, but um when i inflated the he head the qualitex brand i found out that it was too big for the body i'd made so i had to swap it for this head Next, I'm going to create my belt to give it that final elf effect. So using a 260Q in black, just tie it around the waist. Then we use a gold balloon to create the buckle. So to create the buckle, you get your 260Q, a pinch twist, then you create another bubble, like a two inch bubble, a pinch twist, then another bubble, two inches bubble. So you have like a square. And I pushed it together again. I wrap it into the belt. So my buckle wasn't sitting really well. So what I did was I just used the tape to tape it onto the black, you know, to the end. I use U glue dash to finish it off. So guys, I'm going to sign out here. Thank you for watching this video. Um, I hope you enjoy my Christmas takes. That is the Santa, the hair elf, the 
snowman i'm going to be making this period thank you for watching guys